keys, bo 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 keys. What's going on today? We're gonna talk about money. Mainly on YouTube, guys, but I, I want to do a little bit of both. I want to have the beginning, I'm going to talk about YouTube, and then towards the end, I'm going to talk about real life. Um, which, I mean, real it's real money you make on YouTube, so it's a little bit different. <laughs> um, so, um, just, I was doing a lot of tweeting today, doing a little bit of this, all the people talk about not getting paid and all these things, and not every company out there, first of all, pays you right away. Um... I'm not really going to talk about how minimal YouTube makes, I'm going to be honest. It's funny. Let me break some things down to you. I'll show you on the screen, but I don't... Um, it is my business, but I could still tell you about it. Um, I don't mind really showing you, but I didn't have that kind of set up here yet. Basically, I've, I've got 40 views and made 70 cents off of 40 views. Um, I've made... 10 cents off of one view according to YouTube and this is I want to let you guys know I'm with Google I, I literally get paid through Google and actually my what is it y'all call it CRM or RPM or whatever that damn thing is I think it's RPM um, it's actually pretty good through there I'm not going to discuss that with you there's something for you to look up and things like that but it's not bad it's it's enough it's no difference than anyone else would have paid me to be honest so uh, I don't have the I've always been sketchy of being with a, a company because the only reason to be with a network is for them to help you get out there, help to retweet, be a part of a, like a, a group of family. And I have my own family, so uh, I, I was with a network. I was with VidThru, but and then they folded, so I decided to just go solo, solo by myself. And that way, I don't have to really worry about nobody. There's no back and forth, kind of like this. This is just kind of back and forth and people talking about that now. A lot of companies, you do have to meet, get $100 to get paid. I know of a few, but there is that pay you every month. No matter how much you make, if you make a dollar, they pay you a dollar. But um, when I was with VidThru, it was $50. When you meet $50, your threshold of $50. Bucks. Cause, because what happens is it costs money to transfer money and things like that. So they wanted you to accumulate a certain amount and get that. And that's fine. And sometimes I made, I, I want to let you know, I almost made, with VidThru, almost made... I made 500 plus dollars total with when I was with them and I was with them for X amount of time. So um, we didn't just post on YouTube, which was our one thing we had. A, we had own TV, which they're gone, but it was exciting to have. I mean, I was I felt pumped up. I was like the scene enters of the of that. So I should say Hutch because but it, you know what I'm saying. But the point is, is that you got to meet a threshold. You got to meet. Usually it's 100 bucks. Most companies are as hundred dollars. Is, is that it? And it's funny because I've heard a lot of people talk about this, but it's it's just, when you sign a piece of paper, two things. First of all, it's a legal bond contract. Companies don't just get you to sign a piece of paper. They just type up and it, it's a contract. It's a legal document. The second thing is, is that all, everything you have, when I first got on with it through and they sent me the paperwork, it was like, it was, it's not a, it, it was a, it, first of all, what, what happens is, is it's a, they do have a pre- like a one page summary of everything and then they have a 50 page document um and you have to sign the summary that kind of puts you in free out of free agency and then it depends on every company does it different but that's how it was for me and then me and my wife actually sat down and we read the whole page to make sure i mean it was it was a big deal it was like wow getting making money off of playing video games it's kind of interesting but and then that's it, you know. Um, now it was vid through the best at getting you your stats and things like that. Well, the only they were. Unfortunately, what happens is is just like other companies, um, like full screen, is with this person, is with this. Does that make sense? Like it's hard to explain exactly. Uh, nowadays, everybody's getting canceled out. Um, um, little networks are falling at the wayside and big networks are taking over people who have money are taking over they they realize this between 2012 and 2014 there was a huge market for youtube video game commentaries and big time companies not big time companies but people who had money to invest invested wisely and that's smart it should be like that if that's the way it should be there is millions and millions and true i would almost put it billions of dollars to make in this industry and what we make as a small time commentator is small smidges. So, but people bitch about not getting paid. And then they, what happens is, let's say, let's say you get, to, okay, let's say your threshold is $100 and you get to $80. If you leave, 
They do not have to pay you that eighty dollars. Just to let you know. Just like now, I have X amount. I got about forty dollars accumulated on Google, and their threshold is a hundred bucks. If I leave now, if I say, "Hey, I don't want to do this," um, then they would keep their for that's their forty dollars. Now, the interesting thing is, it sits there forever in Google because Google AdSense is more than just YouTube. It's Google, not just YouTube. So there's other like you can use Google AdSense on websites. I wish I knew how to do that. I wish I that's not really my expertise. I need an assistant. I wish I. Um, Personally, I wish I did this 10 years ago, but the point is, is that people complain and people bitch and sometimes they don't understand. It's just straight hate. And I understand it. You're, you're pissed off, you know, um, and that's for sure. I've, I've actually had VidThru pay me before they got paid by Broadband TV because they were douchebags. I'm, I hate to say that. I don't want to talk bad about anyone, but that is the truth. Um, they never gave us stats. They never gave us this. They never gave us that. And they were horrible. They, they didn't care. They told us one thing and they did something else. And that is the truth. I don't care. Um, they could block this video. I don't give a shit. But that is the truth. Um, and one thing about OWN, once they realized that we're making money for them, they were really good about stats. They gave it to us every month. And they were amazing. I wish they were supposed to get bought out. But I think they just shut down completely, which is kind of sad because that's where the money was. Um, so, I don't know. I, I want to know what you guys' opinion. Making money on YouTube is... It's not a tremendous big deal, but it is, it's a big deal. You want to get paid. I don't care if you make a dollar. Um, I almost went with this network because they pay every month. Yeah, I only might have made 40 bucks, but it's my 40 bucks. That 40 bucks could get me a game. And all it takes is one video to accumulate that money. To, and, and let's say I get 50 bucks, and I get my 50 bucks that month. Uh, I do like the monthly. Look it up. Do your research. Before you jump on a network, take a month. Sit there, talk to them, answer. If they don't answer your damn questions to begin with, that means they're not going to answer your questions when you join them. So um, I almost joined a network, but I was like, I don't know. I'm on the fence. I, I, I really want to, but I don't because I want to get paid every month. That would be really cool just to have that money in the account. Um, and that way, if I have to stop this, I have my money. If I stop now, my money is gone. So and I'm not, I don't want to ever stop. But if things get really rough in life, I got to do this, I got to do that. I don't really truly know what's going to happen. But it could happen. Now, um, this video actually will come to an end. Talk about money in real life. Save. I give you a quote of the day. And this is real life stuff. My grandma taught me this. She's, it's never about how much money you make. It's about how much money you save. Now, don't get me wrong. In the same regards, in quotations, it it's about bills, paying them, expendable money, keeping... What I usually do is... And when okay, you pay all your bills, you have money left over. Half goes to savings, half goes to doing the shit that you want to do. That's a good rule of thumb. It don't matter if it's ten bucks. I'm gonna be honest. At the end of the day, if your bills are paying you ten dollars, put half in savings, five dollars, take five bucks, go buy some candy or some drinks. So you know what I mean? Does that make sense? Like, and that's a good rule of thumb. I'm telling you, if you live by that that code, you will be better off. And that's it, guys. And like I always say, my name is Bill Keys. Don't forget to leave some comments on what you think about this whole money youtube thing do you get paid did you get paid please i would like to let i would like to know you can even put what network you with did they pay you i'm with this network now blah 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 i don't really care i just want to know how you feel and like i always say my name is bill keys and you guys out there have a great and wonderful day bingo bango
I shouldn't die like this. You're letting me go? You'll fight another day. Come on. Not bad. Not bad yourself. With the opponent. PlayStation 4. This is the greatest place we could ever be. Like the video. <laughs> like the video. That's right. Tell them.